An explosion in southern Gaza killed eight Israeli soldiers, the deadliest attack on Israeli forces in months. The incident occurred in Rafah, a key Hamas stronghold, amid ongoing conflict since Hamas's October 7 attack on Israel, which killed 1,200 people and took 250 hostages. Israel's response has resulted in over 37,000 Palestinian deaths and severe humanitarian crises in Gaza. The attack may fuel Israeli protests calling for a ceasefire and highlights domestic tensions over military draft exemptions for ultra-Orthodox men. Despite international pressure for a ceasefire, Prime Minister Netanyahu remains focused on defeating Hamas. The Israeli public is deeply divided, with protests demanding a resolution to the hostage crisis and new elections as Netanyahu's popularity wanes.